So let's talk about range. You've had, I've had a Bolt, you've had a Kona. We've spent experience driving different ones as rental cars, our own personal ones. We've spent a lot of time in both of these two vehicles, in cold climates and hot climates. So what about range? The range on the Kona was, was better from what I remember. Yeah. And so I think if I remember correctly, the Kona always outperformed what the EPA estimate was for range, especially in warmer clients like you were saying. If you're looking for, again, longer range, the Kona is going to be a better choice for road trips. So on paper, what Mike's saying might be a little confusing because the EPA rating between these two cars is like one or two miles different. It's like around 258 and 259, something like that. However, if you look at the Edmunds real world range test, you'll see that the Hyundai Kona EV, uh, I believe it was the 2022, got over 300 miles in actual real world testing. Now, when they did that same test with the Chevy Bolt, I believe the temperature, uh, they can't control the temperature, but they control the course and the track and the length and the speed. The Bolt came in at around 270 miles. So the Kona, time and time again, even when you go through Reddit or you read forums, it seems to get a little bit more mileage in the real world.